We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. A good matchup here for you tonight between the Arizona Diamondbacks and the San Diego Padres. The D-backs enter today's matchup with an 11-game winning streak on the line. They'll try to notch their 12th straight next. Zach Logue will be on the mound for the series opener. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? Hey, man, we're getting a look at a guy that's really been struggling lately. In his last three starts, he has a whip of over 1.50. Lots of base runners, lots of hits, and Eddie. lots of walks. And that doesn't add up to very good performances. So he's going to look to turn things around in this one here today. First pitch on its way. And he turns this one around high and deep to center field. Looking up is the center fielder. See you later. Over the wall, a home run. So a solo shot here to left center field. So he just continues to club the baseball at an alarming rate. And the Diamondbacks strike first. It's one to nothing. Wow, talk about a guy getting hot, right? Hits a bomb, hit one yesterday. Usually when he gets hot, he starts to hit them in bunches, and this could be the beginning of a very, very good hot streak. Stepping up now, Eddie James. Now he went deep in his first at-bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. And that's been the entire offense so far in this one. They've been shut down other than that. All right, come on now. Ready One to time. deliver. Here's the That's first fine. pitch. The wind up and the 0 1. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Carroll is underneath this one, and that's out number two. At the plate, Corbin Carroll, 0 for 1 now for him here in this one. Fielder, Corbin Carroll. The 2 2. Swung on and hit in the air to left. James is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Stepping in, Eddie James. He flew out in his last at bat. First offering on its way. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. On he jumps on this one. It's high and deep to center. A ball that's carrying. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Stepping into the box, Eddie James, as the switch hitter will take his cuts left handed here. Really doesn't matter what side the plate of this guy bats from. He hits very well. He hits right-handed pitching very well, swinging left-handed, and swinging from the right. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. So nothing happening this time around. We'll move on now to the bottom half of the seventh. Get up and stretch. The Padres lead it 4-3. to three. Hey, the more things change, the more they just stay the same for this guy. That's save number 45 of the year. He's taking advantage of nearly every opportunity. And this evening's contest comes to a close. 5-3 the final. San Diego used a nice fifth inning to take the lead, and they never gave it back. Zach Lowe earns win number seven on the season. Brian Redmond wraps it up for the save, his league leading 45th of the season. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Prezak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter, at MLB The Show. Final life score for our ball game tonight for the victorious San Diego Padres. Five runs, ten hits, one error. They left 12 men on base.
We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Tonight, an intriguing matchup between the Arizona Diamondbacks and the San Diego Padres. It's time for Padres Baseball. Next. Howard Kida gets the start for San Diego in this one. What's your take on him, Dan? Hey, Matt, it's not easy to bunch anything together against this guy. In his that last three starts, he has a whip of under 1.10. So we may see some hit and run. We may see some bunting. And we may see some running because he hits it high and deep out to center field. Center fielder looking up and off the batter's eye for a home run. An impressive shot to dead center field. So it's a solo shot to dead center. So he just continues to club the baseball at an alarming rate. And the Diamondbacks strike first. It's one to nothing. There are certain guys in every lineup that you do not want to beat you. And this guy right now is swinging the bat so well, I'm not giving him a chance to do anything. He's too hot right now. Ready for another chance, now Eddie back. James. He went deep in his Eddie. first at bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. Boy, this guy right here in that last AB. How about straightaway center field? He hits a bomb, and as a pitcher, you're trying to pitch to the big part of the ballpark. But a guy like this, if he has pop to hit it out the center field, I might have to think pitching this guy down and away down on the corner. Boy, there's another base hit, and this is just kind of like that gift that just keeps on giving. D roll both teams piling up the hits and we're just in the third inning yeah their ears were open on both like sides you. during the okay. pitchers meeting today good plan at the plate a lot of execution from the offensive side on both sides runners on the move for second got him swinging and that will end the inning diamondback strand a pair they still trail here it's six to two Stepping in and ready for another shot. Oh, Andy Yerzy, runner in scoring the position with two gone. Andy. Two out here and a runner at second. Yerzy. Skied in the air to straightaway left. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. So it's two runs on one hit, no errors, and one man left on. On to the top of inning number five we go. The Padres lead it eight to two. In now, Howard Kida. Up next for the Padres, the pitcher, Howard Kida. Fly ball out to straightaway left. James is there and he'll put it away to retire the side. One left for San Diego. But no matter, they lead it 8 to 2. Hey, Digging in and looking for more, now Eddie back. James is off to a fast start Eddie. in this one. Two for two, hey. including a home run. First pitch of the at bat on its way. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Carroll is there, two gone. Striding into the box, Eddie James. He flew out in his last at bat. Almost, Matty. Almost went deep his last AB. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this AB. On the year, James is carrying around an absurd batting line. There's a swing and a drive, and everybody's just going to sit back and watch that one fly. A no-doubt home run. A solo shot here to left, his second of the game, as they've cut this deficit down to four.
at the plate. Eddie James will swing it from the left side right here. This guy's having a pretty good week so far in one game. His last at bat is second home run of the game. We'll see if they'll pitch him a little bit. Oh, and look at this. High in the air and deep. And when this ball comes down, they'll have taken the lead home run. A solo shot here to straightaway right field as they've taken a one run lead. Well, you have a great night in hockey. You score three goals, and that's a hat trick. But how about hitting three home runs in one night? That's the baseball equivalent of a hat trick. And that's all. Awesome. Hey, the more things change, the more they just stay the same for this guy. That's save number 45 of the year. He's taken advantage of nearly every opportunity. 11 to 9 is how this one ends. The Diamondbacks win for a division leading 110th time. Danny Cortez gets the win in relief, his sixth of the season. Carson Romero records the save, his 45th on the year. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. The final line score for the ball game tonight. First for the victorious Diamondbacks, 11 runs, 15 hits. We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of baseball on MLB Network. Tonight it's game three of this four game set between the Arizona Diamondbacks and the San Diego Padres. Live baseball here on MLB Network, and it comes your way next. Mackenzie Gore will be the man on the mound for the Friars. Dan, any thoughts? You know, every pitcher comes out of spring training hoping they can make somewhere between 30 to 35 starts. This guy will be making start number 30 on the year. He's reliable, he's dependable, and he's been pretty good all season long. 30 starts, not an easy thing to do. Batting third. Now at the plate, Eddie James watches fully in effect these days as he's potentially closing in on a historic triple crown. He leads all three categories. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Gone! So a solo shot here to left center field. So he just continues to club the baseball at an alarming rate. And the Diamondbacks strike first. It's one to nothing. What a way to get things started while playing on the road. Top of the first and a big fly, just like that, they take the lead. Into the box, Corbin Carroll. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The center fielder, Corbin Carroll. That's lifted the other way out to left. James is camped under this one. And he puts it away for the first down. Digging in for his second at bat, Eddie James. He went deep in his first at bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. Yeah, that last at bat, Daddy, he turned that fastball around. He didn't hit it a ton. He didn't hit it a country mile. But hey, listen, a home run is a home run. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. But this one will bend foul. Had plenty of distance, though, as it landed in the upper deck. Fouled off. Wait for your pitch up there. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Center fielder on the run. And he makes the play, but this should extend their lead as the runner tags from third. And the runner from third crosses the plate. It's a 3-0 game. 
So striding forward now, Eddie James earned himself an RBI Eddie. with a sack fly his last time at the plate. Here's a shot to left field and deep. Look at this. And it's gone onto the lower basket of the Western Metal Building. A solo shot here to left, his second home run of the game, and the Diamondbacks have stretched their lead now to 4 0. Yeah, it's a long season with a lot of peaks and valleys, but he's getting hot here in September. That bodes well for him and his team as things crank up in October. We'll see if he can stay hot when it matters the most. Stepping in, Eddie oh, James. Right. Two home runs in two at-bats so far and looking to add to that here. And that last at that when he went deep, he turned around a pretty good fastball. So I'm kind of thinking this guy's a good fastball hitter. So I might want to move that ball. And now this is bobbled out you're in going, center. You're going. Siani rounds the corner and is headed home. He will score. And it's now a six run lead. Well, D Row, you know, they say records are made to be broken. And what a monster year this guy's had. Yeah, there it is, Dan. Most RBIs in one season. I can't begin to tell you, as a former offensive player, what that means. You want to put biscuits in the basket, run scored in ribbies, run scored in ribbies. And this guy's the best in the That's business it. right now. You're a... Runners off for second. Runner, runner, runner. Line drive to left. Uh, nice and That's in there. Run, Base hit. The turn, the turn. Now a long slide, throw slide. to third. Throw hey, won't get right. him. Get the ball for this man. He needs to put that on the mantle. He's been struggling. The season hasn't gone according to plan, but he's staying pot committed and grinded out a nice knock. Striding in, Royce Lewis. One for two with a double on his line thus far. Royce Lewis. Swing and a miss, and they'll dodge a major bullet that time. Two away. Wow, that's awfully impressive right there. The pitch before was really close. Now Called the ball. What does he do? He comes oh, back yeah. with a better yeah. pitch and gets the punch out. Runner! Pitch is a ball. And he'll be tagged out trying to steal third. Digging in, Gabriel Masio. 0 for 2 for him to this point. Gabriel. The one two. And he popped him up. And that's going to fall for a base hit. And not in time as the run scores. Boy, so frustrating as a pitcher. Two strike RBI base hit. The ball wasn't hit very hard, Dero, but from a hitter's perspective, you'll take it any way you can get it. Yeah, in today's day and age where everyone's looking to go deep and can go deep, not. Standing in, Eddie James. Already a pair of long balls on his line in this one, so we'll see what else he has in store here. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. He pulls this one into right. He dives. Did he catch that? He did. What a play there for the first out. Great jump on that ball hit to the gap in right center field. A great diving catch. One of the better plays you'll see. And with that win, number 111 on the year, they tied a legendary 1954 Cleveland Indians on the all-time win list. One of the best regular seasons of all time, folks. 8-2 to two tonight's final. The D-backs set the pace in the division with their 111th win. Casey Mize earns his 12th victory in the ballgame. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak and Heidi Watney on the field, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB Network. Have a good night, everybody. The final line score for the ballgame tonight.
first for the victorious Diamondbacks. Eight runs on 15 hits, one error, and 11 runners left on base. MLB The Show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Should be a good one here this afternoon between the Arizona Diamondbacks and the San Diego Padres. Major League Baseball on the show starts now. Luis Patino is on the mound for the Padres in this one. What's your take on him, Dan? One of the things that jumps out if you look at that stat sheet a very high whip coming into this start one of the things he's going to have to do a much better job keep traffic off the bases keep the walks down try to limit the amount of hits he's had a rough goal that so far this year let's see if he can turn it around in this one batting third now batting Eddie James Eddie. watches fully in yeah. effect these days as he's potentially closing in on a historic go, triple kid. crown. He leads all three categories. It's really hard to put together one of those monumental seasons. This guy's got a shot at the Triple Crown, hitting well over 300 in his last 10 games. First pitch on its way. Line drive. That's a base hit into the right center field gap. This will kick up against the wall now. And he'll coast into second here with a two out double. And he will add yet another game to his incredible hitting streak as it now reaches even further into the stratosphere. You know, Dero, I don't know if this thing's ever going to end. This guy's been raking now for almost two months, and he's swinging the bat just as good now as when this streak started to start it off with that his first cool. base hit. Yeah, it, do, it doesn't seem like he's coming out of it anytime soon. Real. I wonder the pitcher that would create such a tough matchup for this guy to shut him down because he's playing with the big part of the field. Down, down, he can down. beat you in so many different ways, and this number's getting just straight ridiculous. I know one thing, he earned that free pass right there. He was tempted with some really good pitches, but he stayed disciplined and drew the walk. Stepping into the box, Dominic Smith swinging it well so far in this series. He's three for nine. Come on, big guys, keep it going up there. He struck him out in and out of trouble as the inning is over. Diamondbacks strand a pair and now the Friars will get their first chance. No score. Next to the plate for the Padres Andy Yerzy the first baseman Andy bottom of the second here with no score. Yerzy. This is hit the other way out toward left field. James comes on now and puts it away for the second out. Digging in to try it again. Eddie James. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Yeah, he jumped all over that first pitch last time up. Interested to see if he has the same approach this AB. Bases are empty here with two men out. Hard hit ball to second. That's through for a base hit. He's now two for two in this one. So that's now two hits for him here today as he finds the hole into right. And you can see there he currently holds the top spot on this Arizona roster in that category. So here's the cleanup hitter, Will Benson. Will. He's running. Swung on and missed, and that's the final out of the inning. Eddie James and he always poses a threat of course Eddie. one of the true superstars in the game today. Oh, big in. Let's get in. See it drive it. Let's go right here. First pitch on its way. A swinging bunt out in front of the plate. All right, hold on, hold on. And right they there. get to force it home. Whatever works is the side is retired. 
So they do strike for two, but it could have been much worse as they strand the bases loaded. On now to the bottom half of inning number four. It's the Diamondbacks three and the Padres nothing. Standing in, Eddie now James, back. two for three with a double Eddie. on his line so far. Hey, what time? Right now. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Swing, and there it goes. Deep to left. No chance at bringing this one back. And it's gone onto the lower basket of the Western Metal Building. It's a two run shot to straight away left. So he just continues to club the baseball at an alarming rate as they open it up to six to two now. Well, d -Row, you know, they say records are made to be broken. And what a monster year this guy's had. Yeah, there it is, Dan. Most RBIs in one season. I can't begin to tell you as a former offensive player what that means. You want to put biscuits in the basket. Run scored in ribbies. Run scored in ribbies. Ready to take his now, hacks again. On, Eddie James Eddie. as he'll look to follow up the two-run homer he launched over the wall last time up. The last at that many V. We heard this guy's a good fastball hitter. He got a fastball and didn't miss it. We'll see if they pitch him a little bit. And meanwhile now, here's a drive out to right center. And this ball is going to clear the wall. It's a home run. Solo shot to right center, his second of the game, as it's now a six-run ball game. Well, they've got the elevate and celebrate thing working in this one, guys. That was their fourth big fly of the game. Matty V, Dero, I don't know what you think, but this is this is like crazy. Fourth round. Digging in now for San Diego. Brett Beatty, 0 for 4 with a strikeout thus far. San Diego down to their final strike. That's lifted the other way out to left. Left fielder is on the move, makes the catch, and that's the ball game. Well, he didn't even break a sweat in this one. Three pitches, he gets the out and heads to the clubhouse to celebrate. Can't do much better than that. Eight to three is today's final. The Diamondbacks with the division leading 112th win. Alec Hansen records his 14th winning decision of the season. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. The final line score for our ball game this afternoon for the victorious Diamondbacks, eight runs, nine hits, no errors. They left.